Hello and welcome to today's training. My name is Eddie Sand and we're going to talk about how to save time with your outreach and get booked with quality prospects and potential partners. Let's start with the urgent problem. Social selling has become the most popular outreach technique for most sales professionals and solopreneurs. But what is social selling? Here's what I found in Wikipedia. Social selling is the process of developing relationships as part of the sales process. Today, this, is, this often takes place via social networks such as LinkedIn, Twitter, Facebook, and Pinterest, but can take place either online or offline. And what I'm going to cover through this training is specifically focused on LinkedIn social selling process. So let's look at the big problem. The biggest problem that we have as professionals in this field is that we don't have enough time in the day to do all the research and to find the qualify or quality prospects that we need and also to make that personal connection with each individual prospect. But that's been solved. What I call is LinkedIn outreach automated bots. That's just the way I call them. We also know them as lead generation software, specifically for LinkedIn. And these are just a few of the major players. There are about top seven of them, but I just put a few here. Now, of course, with any software like this, there are pros and cons. The positive is that when you use them properly, they are effective in producing prospects, the right prospects. And the price is right at about $100 or less per month based on the, the type of program and, uh, and membership that you get. But here's the negative. It's a bot. It's an automated bot. And if you use this wrong, incorrectly, then LinkedIn will restrict your account. And most of these lead generation software companies, they're actually providing the typical call calling scripts and the all sales tactics, which again, it makes it much higher chance for you to get restricted from LinkedIn. So here's how I've solved this problem using a unique framework, my unique framework. I call it the ABC framework, active business connections. Be active. That's very important. Be active in posts and events that matter to you and your business. Share business content. Remember, this is not Facebook where you share your personal stuff. This is business and this is a business platform. So share business content from others that you follow or your own. And finally, request connections with a personal touch. Build relationships and move the conversation to a scheduled call. And I'm going to focus today on the connection part. So here is a quote directly from LinkedIn. This is what the, their stats show. They say that leading with a common connection is powerful and can increase the likelihood of an appointment by 70%, 70%. So your chances are pretty high when, when the connection is done right. So how do we do this right? I'm going to share with you an example right now. This is my example, and I'm going to use the software that I use, Skylead. So if you don't have Skylead, you can go and use my link to get a week trial and test it out for yourself. You can go to www.eddysand.com forward slash outreach. And thank you for doing that. So when you get to the Skylead dashboard and you have linked your LinkedIn account with them, the first thing you want to do is create a, a new campaign. You see that at the top, create a new campaign. I've circled that. Then the next thing is the next option. As soon as you click that is going to be to create the type of campaign that you want. Now I've circled two because those are the two that are most responsive. And I'll show you that in a moment. LinkedIn search results and post engagements. Make sure that you name it something, the campaign, something to keep track, of course. And then you add that LinkedIn URL, either for your search results or that post that you're going to follow and engage with. And then finally, you choose second connections or third connections. 
notice I X'd out first connections because those are people that are already connected with me. So right now what I'm going to do is you're probably asking, okay, how do I get that LinkedIn URL? I'm going to show you that right now. All right. So let me show you here. This is the LinkedIn results. Uh, when you search for results specifically with all the filters that you want, I'm showing you an example of a LinkedIn spark event that happened a while ago. And how do you find events? You just type in the search box box up here, what type of event you want to go for and just say sales event or advertising or marketing event. And it'll show you the dates that are uh, scheduled to, to start. Anyway, when you attend an event, they actually give you access to all those people who are attending the same event like you. And when you click on that, it'll give you the results, the search results, right? For those people that are attending that event. And you can use all type of filters here of who you want to connect in that event that you're about to attend or that you have attended. And then you go up here to the top that's where you click and highlight. That's the link, the URL LinkedIn link so that you add it into Skype, um, uh, into, uh, Skyly. Okay. Now the next thing about this one is you can go to posts. So for example, I'm going to go to one of the posts that I, uh, been or that I had before and right here, this is a post. Now, how do you get the link of that post? You, when you see in your, in your feed, the type of post that you want to engage to just go to those three dots right here. And it says copy link post. When you copy the link, just paste it back on your URL bar and it'll take you directly to that post. Highly recommend doing something before you even create the campaign for posts, go ahead and engage in that post. Notice that's my comment there. Uh, and then make sure you see, here's another engagement with somebody uh, right here that com commented. So make comments on comments and then comment on the post. Once you do that and go as far deep as possible, you see, here's another one as far as you can, then you can go ahead and do the same thing. Copy the link up here and paste it into Skylead. Okay, great. So now that you've entered this information, the next phase or the next step in this process is the premium LinkedIn accounts only. This is usually turned off. Um, go ahead and make sure you keep it off because it's basically going to reach those who are only paying. Um, so if you turn it off, it's going to reach everybody, but again, it's your option. So that's why I put a question mark next to that. When you click on the advanced, uh, and, and you uh, click on the drop down, it's going to automatically highlight or choose only unique leads and no pending connections. Leave them like that. Again, it's up to you to turn them off, but I, I recommend you leave it like it is. The next step after that is you now get the chance to create your smart sequence. Now notice at the top, right? I have circle sequence, temp sequence templates, and they give you a few options. Let me show you. So the few options or suggested templates are these. Now, remember what I told you at the beginning that these companies are, are giving you templates and messages or scripts that are pretty much old school and really pushy at times. So you don't want to use their messaging or their scripts, but you do want to get some ideas from their templates, their campaign templates. Now I highlighted two that are very popular and that I personally have used post reactions and event attendees and notice their percentages are pretty high in acceptance rate. So those are the ones that I will say play around with, but I'm going to show you the one that I created It's a really basic and right to the point. So you start with the lead source. That's usually when you create your own, that's going to be the first thing that you want to do followed by an invite to connect. And these, this one here has a message. I'll show you in a moment what it says. Then if they do connect, of course you send them a second message. Notice that if they don't connect, you go ahead and view their profile or, or, or not you, but of course the software is going to view their profile and then immediately it, you're going to follow them. That's it. That's how simple it, and, it, and it works. This is a simple campaign or smart uh, automation system here. So let me show you now in regards to the invite to connect and the message. So notice the invite to connect the connect message. This is the personal touch. When you first connect, allow this connection to be personal. 
So notice that you can have certain things in your message, but see what I did at the beginning. I have reminded them where we are engaged in, whether it's in an event that we have signed up to go and attend or attend it or a post. So at the bottom is just kind of giving them a little uh, startup to, to continue the conversation. Uh, I usually just tell them, Hey, you know, what, what good is attending events or what good is connecting or engaging in posts, uh, with really cool people, unless we actually connect. Right. So it, just, just start the conversation. Again, this is part of my ABC framework, uh, in how to actually communicate with them. Notice the message one, the second part here, this is when they do connect, say, thank you. There it is. Thanks for connecting with me. Now you usually want to start the conversation or continue the conversation this way with an open-ended question. So here is an example. It's been a new world of virtual events, hasn't it? And I get a lot of feedback from that, right? So, and be personable. So make it to where this is the real you. And then at the bottom of all this, you see at the bottom right, uh, schedule campaign, start date, start time, and your time zone. Just make sure that it's the right time zone and the time that you want to start this campaign. And then you'll have the option to take it away and make it active. So what happens next? The next part is you wait for the software to work for you to start connecting and engaging with the people who actually responded to this automated messages. And notice that's the example right here. You start to do that and you build the conversation. You build that relationship and lead them. Eventually it will lead them to either ask you to connect and have a conversation over the Zoom, over, over the phone, not the phone, the Zoom uh, calls, or you just go ahead and make the invitation. It's really cool stuff. All right. Awesome. Well, thank you so much again for being here with me. I appreciate you. If you want to connect with me, go to LinkedIn. You'll find me by typing in Eddie Sand. And that is me right there. And just want to remind you, if you do want that week trial with Skylead, go ahead and please use my link, which is www.eddysand.com forward slash outreach. Have a great day.